outside. We outside. We outside. outside. We outside. I think I'm crazy. Stay up and baby. And thought I was crazy. Stay up and Welcome back to another day. He chooses to shave his hair, his beard now. I'm literally trying to film my intro. I literally always forget that I have to start the videos with an intro. Okay, I'm gonna wait for him to finish, then I'll film an intro. Hi guys, welcome back to another weekly vlog. I am starting off my vlog today because we have a fun weekend planned for y'all. Oh, I have a fun weekend planned for y'all. It's one of my friend's birthdays this weekend, so she has a fun list of festivities that we're going to be going through to celebrate her and i'm super excited so i literally just got ready and i know i'm starting the vlog before like the get ready with me but i'm gonna like um show you guys like how i got this makeup look together i literally even realized i made a mistake on the makeup if i'm being completely honest because i used a darker shade of eyeshadow but i feel like it still kind of goes especially with the red lipstick like it's making the lipstick pop more y'all let me know in the comments if i'm the lulu but you know the lulu is so lulu right anyways i we are headed to eco lounge for a turn up night your girl already looks so cute so i'm literally so excited but yeah i wanted to start off this vlog and just like show you guys what i am up to um i hope you enjoy it it's gonna be a fun one so make sure you stay tuned don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on any content from me if you are into lifestyle travel fashion beauty content fitness even health i am definitely the girl for you and i'm my channel is about like i guess like my life obviously but navigating your 20s while balancing a tech job and that makes sense. but anyways i'm gonna let i'm gonna end it here i'm gonna end this intro here and get into the vlog i hope you guys enjoy <laughs> bk says hi and you guys are gonna see him later in the vlog too anyways bye you see my bitch, say she had bad Anytime I die, I knock it out No rubber band, no rubber band Every time I put down, they show me that If I know loud, she got my back What do you do? I'm happy that What do you do? Say everything I do is for my woman Anything I talk, when you talk, I go do one uh -huh. Me and other, see another girl for my visuals Loving you, loving you, now in my ritual Okay y'all, I just finished my makeup and we are doing a red lipstick look. It's giving Lady in Red, so I'm gonna go get dressed real quick. We're headed to this spot called Echo Lounge for my friend's birthday turn up. She's celebrating her birthday all weekend, so this is day one. Um, I literally realized that I used Sorry, I'm just trying to get some moisturizer to re-moisturize my hands. I literally realized that I used the wrong eyeshadow and I just hope like the makeup doesn't look intense because I kind of used a darker brown shade from what I usually use. I was on the phone and that's why I literally just finished this video with a full beat even though I was in the middle of doing my makeup. And I just feel like, I just hope it doesn't look too intense. Like I'm looking at it in the mirror and it kind of works. But I was supposed to use a lighter shade, so I'm not really sure what to do. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. This is what we're working with. Um, I'm gonna go get dressed and I will see you guys later when I do the little get ready. Okay, y'all, I just got dressed. I want you guys to help me pick. I don't know, I feel like I'm feeling the pearl set just because it matches 
Let me reduce this, it's too tall. I'm too short, actually. Okay, so I think I'm feeling the pearl side more because it matches the pearl details on the dress. As opposed to the gold side, or maybe this is just not the earring for this dress because it's giving weird, but the pearl earrings are popping up. So probably, I'm going to do the pearl earrings. But I wanted to show you guys my accessories that I paired up the dress with. I just, let me just put this on real quick. I'm also looking for my gold shoes. I cannot find them for some reason. But yeah, I'm doing this like chunky um, gold bangle I got from Shop Koi. I have these rings I got from called Gaia. I've been loving these lately. I feel like these are just like good statement pieces. And I just paired it up with my black Dior saddle. Um, this is just like a good bag. Oh God. This is why I just hate my boho braids when they're freshening because they get stuck on everything. But yeah, black with your saddle and I'm gonna wear my gold shoes. I just can't find them at the moment. So y'all will just have to see it later. I'm, I'm just packing up my little like makeup bag, you know, or like my touch up makeup because we're going to the Airbnb that all of the people are staying at before we head to the club. So we're gonna go pre-game. I, mean, I don't really know what I'm pre-gaming if I'm being completely honest because I'm not really drinking tonight, but yeah, I guess I'm just going for company. I'll probably eat because I haven't really eaten and I'm kind of hungry. But yeah, y'all will not even imagine. I like, Why is he asking me to wear his bracelets? When, what, what would you do if I wasn't here? A little bit. Oh God, and they're so, so hard to wear. And me with my nails, I literally almost broke my nail today when I was taking a shower. I'm gonna have to make a nail appointment either like later this week because tomorrow's already like fully packed apparently we're supposed to have like a spa day i don't know if i wake up on time i will be joining the girlies what's up it's this is like the worst when you plan when you do stuff with african people this is just what you plan to it's always a go with the flow type of situation but i'm assuming that everyone's gonna aim to head there at 1 p.m so i booked my lash appointment for 11 30 so that no matter what it's gonna be from, actually no it's 11 a.m so it's gonna be from 11 a.m to about noon so by noon i should be out and i can head to the spa and like relax so at least that's like fun because i haven't hit the spa in forever and your girl is in much need of a massage oh shit anyways y'all i'm gonna head out i think we are done here bk do you want to show your outfit babes this is what my baby is wearing. You know, just a little sweatshirt, you know what I mean? It's cold it's outside, but apparently... I know, it's so cold outside. I don't know what I'm Holes wearing. Don't get cold. Holes really don't get cold. I think that's actually it, yo. I'm just gonna have to like... I don't even know at this point. But anyways, we're just going from the garage to the house. So it shouldn't be that bad. But yeah, I will see you guys later. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> now Mimi getting the tip, that's so funny. Super, 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 super,
Hello guys, good morning and welcome back to another day in my weekly vlog. If you're tuning, tuning in for today, you obviously saw that yesterday. It was so much fun, DJ was lit and everybody was just such on high energy and high vibes and I just, I just feel like we were all just like living our best lives. It was, today is day two of the celebration. I'm actually coming to you guys in the car because I'm getting ready. I'm literally actually late. I have to get going already. But I am going to a spa. So the girls are having a little spa day today. So we're going to go have some nice relaxation and obviously recuperate from yesterday's festivities because tonight again we are going out anyways i want to like keep you guys like tuned for like the rest of the day so we, we're going to this bar now and after this spa we have dinner reservations at i believe eight and after dinner we have another night club or night out or those type of vibes so i am super excited like i love weekends like this because they keep you busy you know and it's like a nice change for once i feel like i'm such a homebody so i'm always home I don't mind it because I love being home, but these are the times when I like going out because it's like, okay, it's a nice break from just always being home, if you feel me. But yeah, we are headed to, what is the name of the spa we're going to? We are going to Spa Castle in Carrollton, Texas. It is 34 minutes from here. I don't know why. So it's quite far. So let's get going and I'm going to chit chat with you guys. Ooh. I think I put the wrong gear. I'm gonna chit chat with you guys while we're e or in the car. I am like so tired. Oh my goodness. Like I literally also woke up this morning for a lash appointment. I mean, I didn't really show you guys cause I literally, I put the appointment at 11 AM and I could literally barely get out of sleep. It was so bad. BK had to wake me up like five times. Like, and after we left the club yesterday we went to an after party spot so we didn't end up getting home to like 5 a.m i kid you not so basically my appointment my lash appointment was at 11 a.m this morning so he woke me up at 9 30 and i literally felt like i was dying i literally i texted the lady and i was like can you please just like let me know if i can come later even if you have to like i have to pay a fee i'll pay it but she was like she's pretty booked for today so like if i don't get my lashes done i'm not gonna have a slot for today so and i don't know why i saved it for last minute because i could have just done my lashes yesterday but anyways we moved it was just like so bad i could you guys like i am still like so tired i feel like while everybody has like slept and like recuperated i'm like functioning on barely like three to four hours of sleep so yeah i'm hoping that the spa is gonna be like super relaxing obviously i mean that's the whole point of spas i'm just gonna go like relax we all have our swimsuits so we're planning on having like a really fun girls spa day so i'm so excited i know i literally have just been like ranting for you guys but yeah i'm gonna end it here i'll take you guys along with and yeah i will see you guys at the spa bye can't believe this my life hey i line they look at me so surprised no compete compete competition for my lady hey 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 okay your body can't do me, okay? It's the right thing. This guy, this guy, love well. I don't want for the night. Hey, I don't want to see Lady, push your body back to me. Okay, guys, I just made it to Spa Castle, as you guys can see. This is where we're having our little girl spa day. I am super excited and I am also super late. I'm gonna go meet up with all the girlies inside, check in, get my robe together, and I'm gonna check back in with you guys with some strawberries, chocolate covered strawberries, and champagne. I don't know why I can eat enough without you, and I can't eat enough without you. If you don't speak, does that mean we're through? Don't like sneaky shit that you do.
banana. Hey, my camera. Oh my goodness. Hello guys, I am back for dinner. Thank you so much, babes. I am back. We had so much fun at this bar. As you can tell, we literally ended up being there like all day and now I'm like running late. So I didn't really have time to like film a little like intro video for y'all, but I am ready for dinner and I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing, which is this really pretty half blazer dress. I love this detail right here. That's what made the dress stand out to me. So it's like long sleeve on one end and like the details here. And I just paired it up with some silver accessories. I have these silver earrings. I have these silver bracelets. Oh, look at my baby. He looks Pretty. so good. We're twinning, we're the all black gang. Sorry, my hair is a little wet. <laughs> Anyways, and we're getting ready to head out. We are going, do you know the name of the restaurant we're going to? Please, this guy is such a clown. Okay. Oh, He's gonna look it up. But yeah, um, these are the details. And I don't have any, I don't have a lot of silver accessories. Y'all let me know any brands so that sell. To, We're going to Paradiso for Pusitano. my friends. <laughs> That's why he said Positano. Okay, because it sounds similar. He's such a clown. We are going to Paradiso for my friend's birthday dinner. The girl, the same, it's the same birthday group. Um, so it's a whole weekend celebration. So this, um, there's different activities all day. And after dinner, we're going to the club again. I'm gonna just wear this to the club. I think that's why I picked this for dinner because I hate having to change and go out again. So yeah, um, this is just gonna work. This is gonna be worn to the club too. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys my outfit for bags. I have this silver clutch from called Gaia. I'm just gonna do the silver clutch tonight. And I have some transparent and silver shoes that I'm gonna pair it up with. But yeah, I will see you guys later because we're kind of running late, so I want to get going, but kisses. I'm 
much for you know taking the time out of their busy weekends to celebrate with Chiman. This is testament of how um, selfless she is because I think she's the most selfless person I know. So, I'm not getting type she type. She. Let's let's close out the night nightly activities on a high. <laughs> right? Let's get fucked up tonight. Hey! To hey. Ellen, happy birthday! Bro, I'm with you today, me. Because I'm with them to That's you, like, like bro. Good morning guys, I am headed out to brunch today, a birthday brunch. Uh, we are running so late, like our brunch reservation was at noon and I literally woke up at 11.50. So it is currently 12.50 right now. I literally had to shower and do my makeup under all of that. BK is already in the car, so I'm just gonna see you guys later and I'll show you guys my outfit at the spot. Bye, or when I get back. Okay, guys. Hello, I am can I literally. Do, can I do the intro today? Okay, BK wants to do the intro, so I'll let him do it. Um, guys, welcome back to. I think she's trying to find a code name for her followers, and I advise her to do a. Slennies. Yeah. He wants me Hi, to start. Slenies. He wants me to start referring to everyone as Slennies. I don't know how that sounds. Oh, we can find yeah. something else. Yeah. Use that for now. Okay, so why don't you do it? You can do the high slennies, then go from there. Hold on. Just run a red light, guys. <laughs> Peace out, Beck. Don't do this at home. Don't do this, please. Yo, we are so late. This is not even funny. And I'm so mad at myself because I've been so early to all the past events. Everyone was literally complimenting me yesterday, saying that they're so proud. She couldn't help herself. This she has nothing herself. to do with him. Please. I've just been very time conscious lately. The brunch reservation was at 12 and it's 120. So she's an hour, 20 minutes late. Yeah, I already one hour, 20 minutes late. I already told you guys that literally our brunch reservation was at 12 and I literally didn't wake up till 1150. I don't know how I don't know what happened, but when BK woke me up for the first time, he said it was 1130. And all of a sudden everybody seemed to be like on time for the brunch. So I was just like, yeah, y'all just go ahead. And we're gonna meet up. We're gonna do what we can. But can we talk about the face beat though? Look at my face. 
I did this under like 30 minutes. Literally, like, it probably took me like 20 minutes if I'm being completely honest. Look at the material. And also, accessories are also slapping. Do you see the deets? All the details. Like, I lo love. I am also wearing the cutest denim dress that I cannot wait to show you guys. So, I will show you guys when we get there. But we're going to this spot called Kitchen and Cocktails. Babes, this is what you're supposed to say when you want to say you want to do the intro. You tell them how last night was. You tell them where we're going and you explain what they're what the mood is about to be. Right, so, so do you want to take over? Sorry, sis. I'm gonna let BK finish it. He's gonna summarize what we did yesterday and where we're going today and the vibes and we can go from there. Okay? Take it away. It's Lenny's. <laughs> hey. Oh Stop my it. god, bro. I ain't doing this bro. Oh uh, no, he doesn't want to do it. Anyways, last night was a vibe, you know. Went to this cool spot called Soul House. But prior to that, we had dinner at this place called um, so. Paradiso. The food was terrible, bro, to be it honest. It was so bad. I felt like we were on like a prison food or something. Not First of all, it was it cold, was and so then it was a party of like 20 people. Yeah. So we had to, you know, do a special custom order because we had a private room, the restaurant. Yeah. We only had like um, two, two options to pick from, right? Some some salmon, on seasoned salmon, and what kind of steak was that? I'm trying, I'm trying to find a proper adjective for that steak. I'm, not, I'm having a hard time. Well, but it was terrible. They didn't even like you know, because I said I want my medium. Yeah. And everything was overcooked, looked like it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so basically the reason why they gave us only two options on the menu was because oh, they were shit. like... Oh, shit! You missed the exit. Yes, I Oh, it's okay. Oh. Guys. <laughs> Anyways. The reason they gave us only two options on the menu was because they said we're a really large party and they want to be able to get our food out on time. But we were still waiting for our food for like at least like 90 minutes because we all like filled up on appetizers. I was so hungry. I hadn't eaten all day. So I literally she ate all the peanut up. bread, bro. <laughs> I fell up on peanut bread. What was that? Was that like a meatball? Yeah. And like a chicken ball. A chicken ball, exactly. It was Mediterranean inspired and like I love Mediterranean food. So peanut bread, hummus, whatever the meat was, it was good. And surprisingly, the, didn't the appetizers end up being the best thing on the menu? Right. Because the appetizers were way better than this first course and the second course had this couscous salad. You didn't even salad. try the salad. You didn't try I it. I did try it. I tried it. I was the already... The salad was untouched, my G. Anyways, I don't know. I... You eat the leaf. Guys, okay. we're going to put a, a picture of the salad in here. Find a picture. Put it in there. So you can see what the salad looks like. The salad, I did try I had got the... We both got the couscous salad and I ate at least four spoons. You didn't eat four spoons, Joe. You didn't eat four spoons. That's a lie. Anyways. So food was terrible, and then what we do after? Honestly, I don't even know. What did we do after? We went to the Airbnb, right? Oh yeah, we went to the Airbnb to pregame. Then after, literally, there was like a whole situation happening because one of the guys who was on the part of the group, one of the guys who was part of the group, guys, I'm trying to get my thoughts together. One of the guys who was part of the group, his car, he got a flat tire or something of that sort. So like two hours after dinner was like us trying to figure out like what we should do and stuff like that and his car got kind of messed up so I felt really bad for him. Anyways, so that kind of like slowed down the pregame vibe if that makes sense because everyone was just like super stressed. But we all like took some shots and we headed to Soho House after and we all got really lit so it still ended up being a really fun night. Yeah, um, celebrations and events are just always very hectic. That's what I've come to realize. Something just always happens at this point, so you just have to thank God for blessings and hope every disappointment is a blessing, you know? But yeah, guys, I'm gonna get going. Oh my goodness, we've been talking with this music in the background the entire time. I hope it doesn't copyright. Almost there. Uh, I think I just need water. I'm so tired.
outside. We outside. We outside. outside. <laughs> all right, the ice cherry to the tea. I love that for us. I <laughs> love that for us. <laughs> okay, guys, we are headed to Dahlia for the after party vibes. Is it party? We have two guests of honor today. This is hey. Joyce, the birthday girl, hey. and this is Lizzie. <laughs> Bad bitches only, you know. Right. Anyways. <laughs> okay, so we just got to Dahlia. We're gonna get lit. And yeah, I will show you guys the vibes. So, bye. But I don't even know how we made it to brunch. Because, no, like, guys, like, I was dead. Like, four hours. I was dead. We spent for, like, four hours. No, I had no faith in it till y'all. Where really? Yeah. Yeah. Like, because the thing is, though, I heard in the morning, I'm like, yeah. I turn and look at Colin. I'm like, babe, should we? He's like, yes, let's cancel. I didn't yeah. even finish my sentence. Girl. I was just like, babe, she was like, yes, let's go. <laughs> and I was like, then Lizzie was already up. Lizzie said, oh, I was like, yeah, she's like, yeah, all of you motherfuckers are waking up. Oh, and my goodness. I was gonna follow it, it was actually, right? Lizzie said, I'm hungry and we're going to brunch. No, I, I love that. No, I love the fact that we didn't cancel, honestly. No, no like, like, everyone. And y'all want to do a day party that closes at midnight. Anyways, I'm here for the vibes. I'm already up, I'm late. Only, I'm ready to party. This girl's place is a day party and go out at night again. Wait, today? I swear. Hey, no pussy. Wow. I beg. I was, <laughs> this Gen Z is. This Gen Z is. I beg. I beg. I mean, it's like such a like, No, I was like, bro. Are you, see? I didn't hear about that. Going out. I know you're not part of that. I beg. Yeah, and I was like, so are we going out? To, what? Oh, no, guys, please. I, I'm checking out after day party. If y'all want me to see. miss my morning meeting tomorrow, my plan was to check out after out. brunch. No. This guy has said, "What? They, they will work up and want to make up for nothing." I'm like, "What for brunch, sir?" Right? This makeup is not for brunch. He's like, "No, this is not makeup for brunch." My like, that's true though, because I feel like I was almost tempted to come for a brunch like with no makeup. I was like, "Okay." I don't know if we're doing anything after. I think I actually got ready. Right? Was right. right. just for brunch? Yeah, I've been feeling right. Damn. Thank you, girl. <laughs> no, I kid you not. Colin, Colin called Biki at 12.10. I had not even brushed my teeth, guys. That's how That's bad crazy. it was. And Biki said, like, people were on your way. Yes. Some shit like that. Colin said, because he was thinking that like you guys were still like on your way, if that makes sense. Oh, yeah. Then you guys were like, you're in front of the place. I was like, dang. <laughs> I literally, this is the fastest I've ever gotten ready. Like, yeah. And you make you feel I know, you're so Thank you, you guys. Yeah. I literally like, couldn't imagine. <laughs> yeah. This is it. Thank you, Thank you, girl. Thank you,